welcome back to Idolize Makeup Tutorial channel. So you will notice that my background is a little bit different to normal today. I'm actually in Mackay, which is my hometown, and it's about 10 hours away from where I live. So I actually drove up here yesterday to pick up a certain little dog by the name of Greg. If you've been a subscriber of mine from the start, then you'll know Greg is my pug. And while I was away for the last year, some friends of mine have been looking after him. So I've finally come to pick him up. I'm so excited. And you obviously know that that means that he's going to be back in my videos from now on. So anyway, that's why my background is different today, but it will be normal again in the next video when I get back to Brisbane and get back home. But just because I'm in a different place doesn't mean I wasn't going to film for you. So today's video, I'm doing another Snapchat filter. And I'm doing this one because it just popped up in my Snapchat filters today. I don't know if everyone has the same Snapchat filters at the same time, but some of the ones that you've been requesting I don't have on my Snapchat. That doesn't mean that I won't do them, it was just that this one popped up on mine and I was like, that's kind of cool, I'm going to try and do that one. So today I'm going to show you how to do this spiderweb eye Snapchat filter. This one is pretty perfect for Halloween because it's already spiderwebs, which is very Halloween style anyway. And it's nice and easy to do as well, so if you want a simple Halloween look, this is a great one. Okay, I'm going to show you how to do this look right now. Let's get started. Okay, first I'm taking a black liquid eyeliner and I'm lining the whole way around the eye. I'd already done the top of my eye, so I'm just doing the underneath here. But if you're doing this yourself, make sure you go the whole way around. Next, still using that black eyeliner, I'm applying straight lines extending from the eye outwards. I'm applying these fairly evenly spaced apart the whole way around the eye. Then I'm taking a black eyeliner pencil and applying it to my lower waterline. Next I'm applying a very dark purple eyeshadow over my entire eyelid and I'm applying a few layers of this until it's nice and dark and then I'm blending out the edges. If you want details of any of the products that I'm using in today's video you can find them in the description box down below. Going back in with our black liquid eyeliner I'm applying small semicircles in between each of the lines and joining together. This is going to create our web effect. I'm applying these the whole way around the eye until there's only a small gap left at the end of the lines. Now I'm taking a dark red lip liner and lining the whole way around the lips as well as filling them in using that colour. And lastly I'm taking a red lipstick and applying that over the top of the lip liner. This is one of the Sephora lipsticks and it smells so good and they also stay on for a really really long time. And there we have the completed spiderweb eye Snapchat filter look. If you enjoyed this one today, let me know by giving this video a thumbs up. And if you have a Snapchat filter you would like to see me do, leave me a comment down below letting me know which one you want to see. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you would like updates on all my new tutorials. I do at least one new video every single week. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I will see you for the next tutorial when I'll have Greg. Yay! Bye!